Sing. Have letter number 4588. June 17, 2013. Lovely are you in the many forms I am. A form of me by any other name is still a form of me. You play me out in many ways, incredible ways, and, yet, beneath the surface, am I. You are endless notes on my piano. How you appraise the surface of you is endless. One God in many surfaces, yet, still, one God, complete, true unto myself. You, who are complete, see incompleteness. You, who are totality, see parts, not totality. You who see do not see. You who hear do not hear. You, who allude to truth, do not see it, so buried are you in the illusion. What you don't see is. What you do see isn't. What an upside-down world you rally yourself around in. And, yet, even in the upside-downness of the world, there is uprightness. There is truth even as it is hidden among the bulrushes. Moses came out of the bulrushes, and so will you. Consider life in the world your good fortune. Good fortune abounds. Regardless of what the world may say, life on earth is great good fortune. Life on earth is your great coming out party. Life on earth is your debut. You are a debutante on earth, a kind of know-nothing debutante, yet beautiful just the same. You are here on earth on the verge. You are on the verge of great discovery, and it comes down to yourself that you will discover. Certainly, you may be looking for me. Well, of course, you are, and, yet, in your search, you will inevitably find yourself, yourself. You will have found the one of us who seems like two. Ultimately, there is one, and is the one you? Or is the one I? There is no telling. There will be nothing to tell. Which of us speaks, and which of us hears when oneness alone is? In this field of oneness, there are no departures from oneness, not even for a second. Yet, as I say this, you have been oneness all the while you have been unknowingness. You have not known yourself as I do know you. In that case, you have not known yourself at all. You have warbled a bit, at the same time, as you do not know your song at all. Of course, at this stage of the game, it doesn't matter. There is a silent voice that sings, and you are the singer. Voiced, or silent, what a voice you have. And what a song you sing. Sing high, sing low, sing as the bird who sings knowing nothing else but to sing. How wise you are to sing, even what you don't understand what or how you are singing. If we were to, you could say that we are a duet. Certainly, you think of us as a duet, two violinists, as two sides of the room or of the sea or of the sky or of whatever contrasts you seem to see at the moment. And yet what a moment this is, the two of us who in reality are one. Just think of it, oneness. Why beloveds, you are on top of the world. You are a shining light and you are a shining life as beautiful and as great as the first star you see tonight, for we who love our love. No two ways about it. This is your birthright, to love. Sing your heart out, for your heart is mine, and I love to hear me sing in that voice of yours. You are more than my echo. You are my voice. Sing loud. www.heavenletters.org